so first, uh, yeah, looking at the pose, it looks like you've paid um, pretty close attention. Um, one thing to look at is there's a little bit of a got a little bit of that that curve in the spine and the shoulders. You can see slope down at this angle, which maybe you could have pushed a little further. Um, and then you can do the hips at the opposite. But actually, I think you've done a very good job matching this closely. Uh, it was good, good work. Um, so I'm just going to run the character through it. You know, just kind of check it out, make sure. Um, let's just show this. Okay. Okay, that's looking good. Might want to paint some of that down there. Um, well, that's a little weird. It's like it's like this area is moving. Maybe not enough with the shoulder, and then some of this is maybe moving a little bit too much. Um, Oh, I look at it. yeah. Like when I go, when I go backwards, it looks okay. When I go forwards, that area looks pretty pinchy. Um, I might just yeah, just yeah. Especially it looks like it's almost just this one vert here. That's the problem. Um, it's just generally, uh, let me, it's a little bit just uneven here. I might, I'm always a little nervous to just use smooth, but this is definitely a place where, um, might work. Let's do a right mouse click, paint. Let's get cluster weights and... And let's go to what is that left shoulder shoulder L. Okay, and I'm just gonna uh, smooth and hit flood. Well, it's really not doing what I wanted to do. Uh, Let's just try selecting the object and do that. Okay, scapula. Hmm. Yeah, see, that's just dangerous to use smooth. <laughs> that's weird stuff. Oh, that's helping a little bit, except I don't really like what it's done down there, but. I think is there a thing where we can um, there's the I'm trying to remember the um, there's a way to select the verts that are affected by that way is that do you right click on this or something? Select vertices, that's what I'm looking for. So I've selected the verts that are weighted that. I'm just going to grow the selection. Ooh, that's too much. Feels like it went further than just one step. But let's try just flooding smooth just on those verts. Hmm. Maybe a little better. But now it's, yeah. Let me just try growing it. And that's too much. All right, <laughs> I'm just <laughs> trying to like avoid having to do this vertice by vertice is all. I'm just deselecting anything that doesn't really need to be a part of this. Okay, let's try that again. Why does it? You know. Well, Ah, 
I might just rebind this because it's just I'm not having that good kind of a luck here doing this. I wonder if we That's a little better. Right. And then you would mirror it if you like that. I'm not really that thrilled with it. But from the positive to the negative. Oh, shit. That's what you get for not locking everything. Let's... Let's... T <sighs> let's reset this. And I just want to see what happens if we just bind it again, where we end up. I'm just going to delete history, Alt Shift D, and then um, just freeze transformations at it while I'm there. I'll just delete history again, and then let's just bind that one thing again. Um, select to form joints, set smooth line options, and let's try geodesic voxel one. See what we end up with, if it's any better or worse. Actually, I think that's much better. Yeah, that's better. Uh, so just find it again. Ooh, why is that bent right now? That is concerning because reset pose should have. Did you build the hands in this position? Is that what's happened? It's very strange. Um, well, they're working anyway. There's no binding problems. All right. Yeah. Let's just check the head and the eyes. Now you don't want that moving the collar. So for the collar, I would um, probably just want that 100% on the chest. Probably just go into the paint weights thing, go to the chest, and uh, I mean, you might want the clavicle, the kind of the scapula to affect that too, is that thing. But what we certainly don't want is we don't, I mean, how is that working right now anyway? It's, it's working okay. Let's just try to get um, zero weight on the on the head. Yeah, you can see. Look at that. No, oh, that's scapula. Sorry, no. Well, the head seems zero, so let's replace with value of zero flood. Neck. Oh, there it is. But this, the thing is, when we put this at zero, we don't know where it's putting the weight, so... Maybe you want some on that neck one. But at least now, hopefully it won't... Yeah, it doesn't move with the head. And then where is your neck control? Oh, it's like all tiny in there. Yeah, that's all right. Cool. Yeah, um, and then eyes, are those working? Good. Yeah, great job. Yeah, really, there's all the problems. I think just rebind the sweater and just weights on the collar, and I think you're good.